Hey guys, what's up? This is Gom. Going to be doing a let's play of the Amnesia Justine, uh, I guess you could say DLC. Um, it was a free DLC released by the developers for the Portal 2 ARG. So let's get that rolling. This is, like I think I said, blind. I haven't watched any footage of it because I plan to do it, but it took them a long time to release it for retail. Um, but it was free, so whatever. I'm not complaining. fuck is that? Oh. That's okay. Yeah, just, no, no, kill me at the beginning. I don't, I don't mind. Or walk away. I'm just gonna sit down. I'm just gonna chill here. You know, I'm playing right now. It's midnight. It's pitch dark in my room. The only thing I got for me is my monitor. So. What? What we got going for me? I'm a chick. I have boobs. I can't see the boobs. I'm guessing I must be flat chested, but I also don't have legs. I'm a spectral chick ghost. Fuck. Oh, did you look at that? Okay, I gotta crank the wheel. Bienvenue. You are now listening to the sound of my disembodied voice. It will serve you no purpose to look for me, for this is a voice from the past. I bid you welcome to my cabinet of perturbations. It is my study of the human psyche, specifically yours. What? A set of recordings have been prepared to chaperone you through the chambers so ahead. I'm fucking with there myself. There are two parts to the study, and it is up to you, not only to pass, but to figure out what elements are important. Please go on. Move into the next chamber. And just remember, they can all be saved. There is always a way. Who who can be saved? Nah, whatever. All right, let's get moving. Okay, I guess I don't have any oil. Yep, no oil. I'm gonna assume this runs the same way as the main game. I haven't played the main game in fucking forever, but well, we can assume that. I wish I had some fuel. Oil. Right, we're going to the right then. I don't like the sounds of that. Not one bit. But the only way we can progress is forward. Backwards is... is... an option that we will pick should the time arise. This does not see... ooh. I can take it though. Broken ladder. Sweet. I don't know what I'm gonna use it on, but fuck. I'm scared. You ready? I telling you, don't have my weapons. Can't do a liberty kick. Nothing. Maybe I shouldn't close the door. Whatever. All right. Avoid the floor. Open the door. What do we got in here? Oh shit. Why did I stick a fucking monster in here if it could possibly kill me? That's stupid. Stupid me. Stupid, stupid womanly brain. Ah. I 
I'm not gonna risk it because the last time I thought it was fucking with me, it wasn't. Shut up! Oh shit, it opened the door. <laughs> it opened the door. <clears throat> Le 22 Avril 1858. Salutation! I'm not gonna fucking read it in an accent. I don't even know what it's. I'm assuming French. Fucking French. Salutation, Inspector Merritt of the Sorete Nationale. As you very well know, the Chief of Police in Calais has turned my. has turned down my request to pursue Justine Florbell, I guess that's my name, for stealing. <laughs> for stealing my son away. Ever since their affair started, Alois, my son, has forsaken his duties to his family and failed to pursue his career. Since the law seems. I'm able to find a crime within the realm of Mademoiselle Justine's action. I ask you to receive Dr. Victor Fournier later this week. An expert in human psyche believes he may have found a legal way to incarcerate her. If he is able to diagnose her as an hysteric, it would be it would provide you with an ample excuse to have her locked up. Oh. Maybe I'm crazy. Take this bucket. Fucking close it. Can I get up there? Or boxes? Or, well, not boxes, barrels. Woo! Health! In case I get fucked up. Oh, this looks nice. Oh, this looks really nice. Look at that. I wonder if I can play the fucking violin like this. Yeah. Eee, eee. No, no, okay. I'm not a very good violinist anyways. Ha! I can use this to block the door if I need be. I can't pull it out though. Still no gas. Or oil. My bad. Anything here? More blood. Yeah, because I really need to walk into the fucking areas filled with blood. Okay. Whoever you are, if you could help me, I would be much obliged. Ah! Oh. How do I help, help you? Me. Please, can you hear me? It's not too late to set things right. I... I will save you. The chick said to me that I said to myself that everybody can be saved. So we'll find out how to save them. I must use the Bible! The Lord will set you free, young heathen! You will be free and repent for your sins! Or not. Okay, well. Okay. Right! Huh. Well, I'm just doing my womanly thing. Alright. How the fuck am I gonna free him? Ooh, lever! How did you escape? Full the lever! Please, please be reasonable! 
trouble. You don't have to do this. Oh. Ooh. No. No. <laughs> no. No pulling the lever. Can I pull it up? Yep. Let's not do that. Boxes! We have to reach up there. Although, I think, I, yeah, I think I have to get up there. I am Justine. Or am I? I don't know. Okay. Let's see if I can get up there, actually. Probably can't. Visible barrier, yo! I'm going to use boxes while climbing boxes to help me climb up further. So I can continue to get boxes. All right, I'm gonna. Use can you hear me? It's not too late to Listen, asshole! I will not fucking help you if you continue whining. Can you hear me? It's not too late to set things right. Uh. Obviously, if I locked you fucking up there, I wasn't right in the head, anyways. I am a crazy fucking person. I need to be locked up. Damn it! Help me! Please Shut up! Help me. Shit! Okay, come on. I can do it. Just gotta reach, pull, grab, jump, miss. It's okay. All right. It's all right. I got more boxes. So what I'm assuming is, if that guy gets stabbed, it lets down the little thing, right? The little, little, little path up there, maybe a really long ladder, right? However, what I can do is grab all these boxes and work my way up. That's going to be very annoying, but it's a possible solution. I need to do science real quick, people. Physics, more specifically. Box physics. I've measured with boxes. I can stack boxes up as high as I want. With science. <sighs> You're fucking kidding me. Sorry about that. People love interrupting me for no reason. Hopefully it doesn't happen again. It's midnight. Why are people bothering me? Go to fucking sleep. Actually, ironically, they're telling me to go to sleep. Fuck you. I'm playing scary games. Shit. Almost. Just a couple more boxes. I can do this. I just gotta... Yes! Can I grab these boxes? No, they're too big, says me. Ouch! Whew. I don't know why that happened. I tell you, if the fucking monster comes back, for whatever reason, and like, tries to kill me as I'm stacking boxes, I'm quitting. I'm not gonna continue this. Cause I... 
<laughs> I'm not gonna continue it if I'm getting attacked by a fucking monster. That's all there is to it. Ah, oh, this is gonna be an amazing feat of Jenga. So I'm gonna assume that leaving him inside the cell tied to that table is gonna be considered saving him because there's there's no way I'm gonna be able to bust that lock. There's no way they'd allow me to actually fucking interact with this guy. You know, let's just move all these boxes and crap over here. A lot easier access. I just don't want to throw him. How did you escape? I don't know how I escaped, okay? I had set up a way to escape to my, for myself the same way I made myself forget everything once again. Except as a chick this time. Oh, you know what? Let's get these chairs, too. Science! It's what's for breakfast. Have you seen Justine? No! I can't see myself, as is evidenced by the lack of arms and legs. It's gonna take a long ass while, I can tell you that. Huh. Oh, sweet. Fuck yeah, I did it. Alright. I gotta reach that one. Fuck. Jenga, Jenga, Jenga. Uh, 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 Jenga. Jenga. I got a lot of these boxes here, considering that I probably don't actually need that many. Son of a bitch. Hey, you know, fuck the barrels. The barrels are douchebags. They're just gonna roll off. Alright, now what we do need are braces. Yeah, see? That's something we need. Flip them up. Put them on the sides. Stabilization, yo. Aha! Shit, yeah! Alright, that's good, that's good, that's good, alright. How did you escape? Okay, you are actually perfectly safe in there. Um, just remember to read all this Bible. Um, it's gonna be a little hard, but I'm sure you can do it if you just read between the lines. And by that I mean the lines of your mask. Goodbye. Super leap! Oh yeah. What's the point of giving me a lantern if you're not gonna give me oil for the lantern? I'm trying to scare the shit out of me. Shut up, game. I'm gonna keep going forward. There's nothing behind me.
Yeah, let's check out the other way first. Shut up, cockroaches. What the fuck is up with these ancient ass civilizations? Always having fucking cockroaches and shit going around the place. Oh, that's great. Dead end. Of course it is. Shut up, piece of crap. What the hell was I just able to touch? Oh. Punk? Alright, we'll keep this rock. And I will throw it. Even though there are many like it. This one is mine. Psyche? Is my psyche okay? Yep, crystal clear. Because I'm a maniac already. Ow. Right, okay, well, here's a recorded message. What? Go into the blood filled room or go down the safe looking staircase. You know, you guys on YouTube are yelling at me to go through the blood-filled door, so I'm gonna go do the blood-filled door. That's great. Awesome. Congratulations for coming this far. I'm so excited for you. I do hope you managed to save Monsieur Fournier. He was a friend, and a colleague of my papa, you know. No, I don't know. Friendly fellow. A real bon garçon, but frail of mind. He puts up an impressive front, but it is all an act, I assure you. Please, go on. We are just getting started. Ow, fuck! Okay, can I... No, I can't. What the fuck happened in this room? Get that shit out of here. People got fucked up. That's what I can tell you this room did. What the fuck is this doing? Yeah, I'm not seeing much progress. Must be broken. Alright, let's read this note then. Newspaper article, the 19th of March, 1858. Okay. Okay, so we took that guy because of his horrible, horrible performance and fucked him up. Yikes. Gotta be cautious, because I remember the last time I went up a fucking pair of stairs. Oh, that looks pleasant. For now. Ooh, library! Divine inspiration. Time to delve into your spiritual side. What do you see? 
Is the man begging for mercy, or is he being blessed? Perhaps both. Father used to say there were no right answers. Have the light guide you. Yeah, okay. Whatever. Slide one, light slide two. All right. Oh, I like this room a lot more. Slide one. Let's look through here. I gotta have fucking oil somewhere. Aha! Oh, no, just a tinder box. And another. And a note. The test has been going well. The most long term, and in the sense the most promising, is the light box. Having Justine choose a slide, essentially a mood for every day, is a great way to see the larger overall development of her mind. She definitely reads things into the slides I had not foreseen. Her remarkable imaginations turn the characters just about anything, and she is able to effortlessly reduce all her experiences into one of the four character slides. Using the puzzle lock has proven more difficult as she tends to always choose two slides with the characters facing the same way. I've asked her why this is, but she doesn't seem to fully understand what I'm saying, what I'm asking. Okay. Oop, another one. Herbert's letter. Dear Monsieur Flaubel, I am sorry to hear about your Dr. Justine's unruly behavior. Rest assured that this does not diminish your work, nor does it make your idea of a natural developing mind less appropriate as a field of study. I have met plenty of scholars here in London enthralled by your hypotheses and stated that it could be one of the most important ideas of the modern era. You know what, this is really old fucking art too. It has been suggested that the mind is not only molded by experience, but could also be stricken with disease without physiological sign. Perhaps this is the line of thinking that could be applied to your child. I wish I could devote my letter to consolidation, however I write to you with a request. I require passage into Algeria, and I need Frenchmen of great standing to vouch for my person. I am certain the name of Florbel would greatly speed the process of grabbing the person. Okay. Alright, Herbert. I sure hope my father helps you out. That's a good idea. I'm gonna throw all the books I can possibly grab, just in case there's something hidden behind them. This book looks important, but it's not. It's really random. Like, just like some books are grabbable, others are not. I think just like the individual ones are, but the ones stacked up aren't. Like I said, the one stacked up. Hmm, well, I guess there's nothing in here. I was hoping a slide would be in here. Take my magic broom because I'm a witch! Burn the witch! Hello! I hit you with my broom. Yes! Why is this guy taller? Did he just grunt at me? Dick. Cool. Ooh. There's a light in here. Underneath it. Okay, something's there. Something is there. Is there any note? Oh, tender box. All right then. Time to go to the other one. <gasps> Another one. Venus. Who, who are you? Who's there? Hi. Who are you? You burn for this. You'll burn for this! What'd I do? 
I didn't do it. That's for sure. Gonna tell me who you are? Look, I'm trying to save you, buddy. I don't really... I'm gonna need a little of your assistance. How does this machine work? It looks like I put the slines in it. But we're not gonna do that just yet. Ugh, whatever. Useless people. You try to save them, they just do nothing but chew you out. Okay. Sure. Alright, side two. Side one. Slide three. Wait, that was slide one. That was slide, yeah, okay, that was slide three. Slide four. Oh, okay. Two and four! Right? No, three and four. Three. Four. Because they're both looking the same way. Well, one and two are not. See, look. Here's one, and he's kind of like, Sup! I'm Jesus! And then the other one, slide two, is just like, Yo! I poke you with my sword. So yeah, it's either one and two or three and four. We can only hope for the best. Hey, you actually didn't know how to fucking work that thing, but whatever. All right, sir. King of kings. Lord. Three, four, Le Poul. Okay. Not three and four. One and two. Yikes. Uh, I think I killed him, Jim. Well, fuck. I didn't know how to work it. Hmm. It's tempting to revert back. I did want to save him. Oh, uh, well. Damn it. I wonder, is Father David with his god now? Maybe you helped him there. Don't you worry, I'm sure he didn't have a family. He probably wasn't even all that well liked. With the current political climate, I'm surprised someone hasn't killed him already. We can't all be saved. Some don't even want to be saved. Yes, that is a comforting thought. Saves us from trying. Whoops. I didn't want to kill him. I wanted to save everybody that said it could be saved and Oh this doesn't just this this doesn't look nice. Potatoes. I see what you did there. Am I scared of potatoes now? fucking music starting up? Wait, why'd the fucking fire go out? I just realized that. Oh boy. I know how are great!
No, you won't. Oh, oh. Looks ugly. Fuck. If he sees me, I'm gonna fucking charge his ass. He sees me. He sees me. He sees me. He's gonna come back. I'm gonna charge his ass. Cause I. I don't think he's gonna get away. Or walk away. He's not like everybody else. He's trying to talk to me. Uh. <gasps> oh. I still have no fucking oil. Oh shit, he's coming back. What's up? Yo! My name is Gom! You ain't gonna hit this motherfucker! Yeah! What's up? Oh, little bitch! Fuck! <laughs>